Electric vehicles are undoubtedly the way of the future, but it's no secret that the initial costs can be a deterrent for many consumers. The battery, for instance, is undoubtedly the most expensive component of an electric car, which can set you back a pretty penny. Upwards of $20,000, in fact. But have you ever stopped to wonder why this is the case? Well, if you haven't before, you are set to find out in this video. The answer to the question of why the battery of an electric vehicle costs so much is simple yet complex, like most things in life. To pack more energy into an electric car, manufacturers need to source and extract rare and valuable materials such as cobalt, lithium, and manganese. These materials are crucial in the production of high-performing batteries that can power your electric vehicle for longer periods, but the bad news is that some of these elements are either hardly seen or cost a fortune to get them extracted. In recent years, lithium-ion batteries have become the go-to technology for a wide range of applications, including smartphones, laptops, electric vehicles, and even renewable energy storage systems. However, the abundance and affordability of sodium have led researchers to explore the potential of sodium-ion batteries as an alternative to lithium-ion batteries. The coveted element used to power our modern-day battery technology has been known for its challenging extraction and purification process. Last year, the price of lithium carbonate skyrocketed to over $80,000 per ton, leaving many people wondering if we should seek alternatives. Ironically, some of those who overlook the environmental impact of oil and gas drilling are now voicing concerns about the horrors of lithium mining. However, it's worth noting that lithium mining does not take place in residential areas. Unfortunately, common sense and logic seem to be missing in some quarters of the fossil fuel crowd. Enter sodium, a widely available element that is chemically similar to lithium. With sodium carbonate currently priced at around $300 per ton, it's an affordable and abundant alternative to lithium. While sodium-ion batteries have a lower energy density than lithium-ion batteries, they are making rapid progress. Remember, not too long ago LFP batteries were considered inefficient, but now they are almost as energy-dense as lithium-ion batteries were a few years ago. The battery industry is constantly evolving, and sodium-ion batteries will likely continue to improve. Sodium batteries have their own advantages too, but then, what makes them so groundbreaking? Well, not only do they offer a viable alternative to traditional lithium-ion batteries, but they also boast a plethora of benefits that will propel the EV industry forward. With enhanced safety features, cost-effective manufacturing, and superior performance in low temperatures, these batteries are the future of sustainable transportation. In fact, leading companies like CATL and BYD are planning to revolutionize the electric vehicle industry with their cutting-edge sodium-ion batteries. The two powerhouses will integrate the innovative technology into their upcoming EV models, with CATL's sodium-ion batteries set to debut in Sherry's iCar brand of new energy vehicles. While CATL's first-generation sodium-ion cells cost around $77 per kilowatt-hour, the second generation with volume production is projected to drop to a mere $40 per kilowatt-hour. This cost-effectiveness, coupled with the technology's impressive energy density of 160 watt-hour per kilogram, with the potential to surpass 200 watt-hour per kilogram, makes it a no-brainer for EV manufacturers looking to ease their dependence on pricey lithium. It's worth noting that just a year ago, the idea of using sodium-ion batteries in electric vehicles was met with skepticism. However, CATL's groundbreaking technology has proven that sodium-ion batteries aren't just suitable for energy storage and two-wheeled scooters, they're poised to disrupt the entire EV industry. In an unexpected turn of events, however, sodium-ion battery technology has progressed at an incredible pace, surpassing all expectations. It has now become inevitable that these batteries will soon be powering electric vehicles. CATL's recent announcement of their plans to introduce sodium-ion batteries for electric vehicles sparked excitement and anticipation in the industry. But CATL is not the only player in the game. BYD, another major player, also joined the race, announcing their plans to commence mass production of a compact electric hatchback powered by a sodium-ion battery pack in 2023. The BYD Seagull is expected to be the first car to feature this technology with a range of 305 km CLTC and a starting price of about 80,000 yuan, 11,600 USD. Despite the many advantages of sodium-ion batteries, they have one major drawback, lower energy densities. This means that more batteries are needed to match the energy capacity of lithium-ion batteries, which could pose a problem for use in vehicles. 
However, this is not an issue for grid-scale battery storage, as utilities can simply put more batteries in a given space. The shift towards sodium-ion batteries could also have significant geopolitical implications. China, which already dominates the lithium-ion battery market, is set to become the leader in sodium-ion battery production as well, with 16 out of the 20 planned or already constructed factories located in China. However, the country has limited access to the soda ash needed to manufacture sodium-ion batteries, which could prove to be a challenge. But beneath the sun-kissed southwestern Wyoming desert of the United States lies a treasure trove of soda ash that was formed over 50 million years ago. For centuries, the United States has been mining this vast reserve to satisfy the insatiable thirst of its glass manufacturing industry. In fact, the U.S. accounts for over 90% of the world's easily accessible soda ash deposits, making it the go-to destination for glass manufacturers worldwide. As the world moves towards sustainable energy solutions, however, the U.S. finds itself in a precarious position. With limited natural reserves of soda ash and a reluctance to depend on imports from the U.S., China has turned to synthetic soda ash, produced at chemical plants powered by coal. China's synthetic soda ash industry has a sordid history of polluting waterways, with incidents like the collapse of an alkali slag pile in east-central China, which washed away cars and fouled a major river. In a bid to move away from China's hazardous and polluting soda ash industry, the U.S. is turning to sodium ion technology. Sodium, being abundantly available in the U.S., offers a viable and sustainable alternative to lithium, which has dominated the battery market for the past decade. The benefits of sodium-ion batteries are manifold. They are significantly cheaper than lithium-ion batteries, and their performance remains unaffected by the same issues that plague lithium-ion batteries. However, the U.S. is not alone in its pursuit of sodium-ion technology. China is currently leading the race in sodium-ion battery research and development, with dozens of government-funded labs working tirelessly to perfect this technology. Meanwhile, the U.S. lags behind, with only the Department of Energy conducting research in this area. If the U.S. wants to remain a key player in the sustainable energy sector and reduce its dependence on China's battery technology, it must prioritize sodium-ion technology. The abundance of soda ash reserves in the U.S. provides a unique advantage that should not be overlooked. But time is of the essence. The U.S. must act fast to catch up with China's progress in this area or risk falling behind and asking, what happened, in the years to come. So the U.S. has a golden opportunity to lead the way in sodium ion technology with abundant reserves of soda ash at its disposal. The potential benefits of this technology are immense, and the U.S. must act fast to harness them fully. The question remains, will the U.S. rise to the challenge and take the lead, or will it fall behind and be left wondering what could have been? The potential of sodium ion batteries is immense, and the race to develop them is heating up. With major players like CATL and BYD leading the charge, the future of electric vehicles looks bright. Who knows what the next breakthrough in battery technology will be, but one thing is certain, the world is watching and waiting with bated breath. What do you think of this video? We would love to hear your thoughts in the comments section below and if you watched this video to this point, kindly hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more interesting videos like this. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.